Bonjour! In today's video, I'm going to talk about another type of articles, the indefinite article. As a reminder, an article is a class of determiners. It is a word that is used with and placed before a noun and restricts its meaning. Indefinite articles indicate that the noun to which they refer is not specific, unlike definite articles. They correspond to the English a, un. Note that there is a plural indefinite article in French, unlike English. Un is used with masculine singular nouns. For instance, un garçon, a boy. Before a vowel or a silent H, un is pronounced un. For example, un étudiant, a student. Une is used with feminine singular nouns. For example, une fille, a girl. The pronunciation is the same for words starting with vowel or a silent H. For instance, une étudiante, a student. De is used with masculine and feminine plural nouns. For example, des garçons, des filles. Note that in front of vowel or a silent H, de is pronounced des. For instance, des étudiants, des étudiantes. The use of French indefinite articles is similar to English ones. The indefinite article refers to an object or a being, or some objects or some beings, belonging to a wider group that is not known or that is mentioned for the first time. For instance, j'ai vu un chien dans le parc. I saw a dog in the park. This can be any dog. We have no indication about this dog. Note that the singular form can be used for generalizations. For example, un étudiant doit beaucoup étudier. A student must study a lot. We are talking about students in general. This is not the case for the plural form. You cannot say des étudiants doivent beaucoup étudier to talk about the student community. You will use the definite article les instead. Les étudiants doivent beaucoup étudier. Students must study a lot. I hope that everything is clear. Au revoir. Created using Powtoon.